Hey everybody, welcome back. Today we're going to do some wings. We're going to use the holy voodoo and some meat church fajita seasoning. Stay tuned. Going to be great. All right, let's get this chicken rolling. The first thing you need to do to make sure that you have good, crispy, bite-through chicken skin is to make sure that skin is dry. So we're gonna lay out some paper towels and then we're gonna press it dry. So once we get this chicken dried, then we're gonna pat it both sides, kind of squeeze it together, get all the, all the water and all the moisture out. We're gonna reintroduce some fat. And this time we use sp spray Pam. You can use any kind of spray that you want. Duck fat works good. This is a canola oil in the Pam here. It works great. So just spray them down and then we'll lay them out here and get them ready for the, uh, the season. Hey, if you're not sure how to separate these wings down like this, we do have a video. If you'll see that top right hand corner up there, just click that link and it'll take you to a video that'll show you exactly how to clean these chicken just like we have them here. So once we get these laid out, we're gonna do one pan with the uh, Holy Voodoo by Meat Church. Really good flavor in this one. So we're just gonna spread it on very liberally and uh, coat both sides. For the second pan, we're gonna use the Meat Church uh, fajita seasoning. Man, it gives a punch of flavor, plus has a little bit of bite to it when you put it on real thick, and it goes really well with, uh, with wings. Uh, we're gonna coat these at the end with some uh, barbecue sauce. We use the Bucky's brand barbecue sauce. It's just a vinegar-based, uh, mass-produced barbecue sauce, which really, really is thinner and works very good. As you can tell, that fajita mix has some really chunky spicy in it. It is very, very good on wings. Uh, if you haven't tried the Meat Church fajita seasoning yet, you need to. It's good on a lot of things, but these chicken wings with this fajita mix were absolutely dynamite. Give it a try if you have not yet. We're gonna go ahead and get these coated on both sides, real liberal with the seasoning. Gives it a lot of flavor. Then we're gonna get it out there on the smoker. We're gonna smoke these at about 325 to 350 degrees uh like to stay about 325 but sometimes it does creep so we'll see how that goes for about an hour and then we'll sauce in about 20 more minutes what we're shooting for is about 180 degrees uh internal temperature so time's really not a factor we're going to make sure that we cook these to temp so they're all seasoned up and let's get them out on the smoker Voodoo, got the fajita, fajita seasoning. We're about to get down on some wings here. Let's get these things in the smoker. Miller rack. We are at 325 degrees. And we are gonna bathe them to smoke for about an hour and then check them. We'll get them in here and we'll see you guys in about an hour. Hey guys, we're about an hour in. We're gonna look at these wings. Uh, it looks like they're about ready to put sauce on as far as temp goes. So we're gonna sauce them. We'll put them back on at 325 for about 20 minutes or so. Oh yeah, that skin's looking good. It's crisping up. They're ready for some sauce. Let's get them sauced up. All right, we're gonna sauce up only half of them. That way people have a choice. Just get a little sauce on these things. Make a mess underneath, but it's okay. That's what a power washer's for. Just using a thin, vinegar based barbecue sauce, actually store bought. Works real good. Uh, if any of you guys know what a Bucky's is, this is actually Bucky's brand barbecue sauce. 
which is very, very good, in my opinion. I'm sure you got a homemade recipe that's probably better, but. Get those sauce, just sauce on the top side. I'm not gonna worry about the bottom, it'll run around. Put these back on for about 20 minutes. We'll come take them off. They'll be done. See you in a minute. All right, guys. We got about an hour and a half in total so far. These wings are done. Let's get them off and give them a try. Oh, yeah. Looking good. Guys, we got them done. Let's taste them out. Mmm. Crisp, bite through skin. Nothing better than that, fellas. Mmm. See y'all next time.